Okay, folks, this is uh, take three of my video. We'll try this for the third time. I'm making some uh, Italian sausage chili today for a uh, hump day because it's uh, a tad chilly over here, no pun intended, in a beautiful Tower City. It's uh, in the mid-30s, let's say, okay? So I'm going to use some mild Italian sausage, and then I got over here some hot Italian sausage. What I'm going to end up doing is taking this out of its casing, all of it, and mix it all together and put it in here with my ground meat. Right now I got two pounds of ground meat on just a very low setting. All right, I want to brown that up. And once I get all this mixed together, I'm going to put that in this pot with it. So I got two pounds of ground meat hamburger there, 85%. And then over here, these are all basically uh, pound packets. So I'm going to have basically three pounds here and two pounds there. And obviously, that's going to melt down, if, if you will, all right? <laughs> so I'll mix all that together. And then I'll my ingredients is going to be, I got some uh, dark red kidney beans, okay? Just generic brands. It doesn't matter, at least not to me. And then I got light red. And then I, I down here, I got some... Essential, that's a name brand, or a, a, a store brand, uh, light kidney beans. And then I got uh, one can of Great Northern Beans. I'm going to mix all that together, put that in here after it's all browned up. Then I'm going to put in two cans of uh, corn. So this is going to be like a, a chili con corny, <laughs> if you will, okay? Um, I got, uh, and this was on sale, all right? Green Giant, Summer Crisp, all right? You could get four for four dollars. So I, I got four, but I'm only going to use two. Uh, this one here is the the Mexican corn or Mexicorn. All right, it's got the the green and red peppers mixed in with the corn. And then over here, I got uh, just the uh, uh, Green Giant Steam Crisp. All right, that's uh, what is that? That's a uh, a sweet yellow and white corn. So that'll all be mixed in together, as you can see right here. And then my chili packets now they they call for uh one chili packet per pound so i'm gonna use a one uh packet of hot then i'm gonna come over here and i'm gonna try this tex mix which i've never had before uh, that's gonna be mixed in with it and then i'm gonna go over here to my mild and then uh when i put that all in combination i have an extra one here if i need it and I also have an extra mild. So depending on how it tastes, if it's not spicy enough, I don't like it too spicy. But if there's not enough hot in it, I'll add this. But when putting all this in, if there is enough hot but I need some more seasoning, I'll add an extra mild. So that's what I'll be working on here. And I'll get back to you a little bit later on. Okay? I'll let you see... Uh, what my uh, chili concoction is. So if uh, this floats your boat, by all means, uh, go out and buy the ingredients and try it out. And if this one doesn't do it for you, uh, go on YouTube and just hit uh, Italian sausage chili. Oh, and one thing I do have to go with my chili is I got some Fritos, uh, the corn chips. I got just the, the old-fashioned kind, those uh, the small ones. I'd like to sprinkle that on top of my bowl of chili. So that'll just flavor up just a little bit. All right, guys, I'll talk to you a little bit later on.